hi guys in this video tutorial I'm going to teach you how to generate an occlusion ambient occlusion map from blender the ambient occlusion map is called as a light map a light information map which is used for texturing and for visual effect companies it can be also used in gaming some game engine generate their own occlusion map for each and every object ok let us see the steps to be followed to generate in blender so this is a simple model which i done in blender it is freely available in our website you can download it in free of cost ok so to, to generate a occlusion map for this model we have to do uv for this model first so i have done the uv for this model the density of this model is 512256 ok let us apply the 512256 map to this model so that we can see clearly see the density so i am going to enable the raw type as a texture so you can see the square shape so the density, density is matching quite well so let us go back to the texture i am going to select each and every face in this object by selecting select select all ok next in image I'm going to assign a new texture called AO map underscore map that is ambient occlusion map and the, and the with this tritol and height is 26 ok then I'm going to give ok now your texture is applied or assigned to this object so I'm going back to the object mode. Okay, you can go back and the object mode by pressing the tab key in your keyboard. Okay. Next, we are going to generate the ambient occlusion map. For that, you have to go into the world button. Now you will find ambient occlusion tab. Okay, usually it will be turned off. So we have to turn on the ambient occlusion. Okay. The sample value. The sample value is very important in generating the ambient occlusion. If the sample value is very high, the quality of the ambient occlusion map will be also high, and the time taken to generate the ambient occlusion will be also high. If the sample value is very low, the quality of the sample will be also low, and the time taken to generate the ambient occlusion will be also low. So. For this tutorial, I am going to give uh, 5 the blender uh, 4.9. I am using this 2.49. Okay, this version. This version support up to sample value of 34, 32. Okay, next, uh, let us generate the ambient occlusion. To generate the ambient occlusion, go into the render menu, bake render meshes. And you will find the ambient occlusion. Just click that button, click that option. You can see the blender is generating the ambient occlusion. It's very fast to us. Yeah. Okay. Now you can see the ambient occlusion by going back to the texture face material and turn on the drawing method as texture. You can see the ambient occlusion clearly. You can also increase the intensity of the whiteness in this ambient occlusion by increasing the energy level. So I'm going to keep it as maximum value and I'm going to rebake it down again. You can see the intensity of the white will be increased quite a lot. Okay. You can see the whiteness intensity intensity of the whiteness will be increased okay you can change the color of the ambient the occlusion to any color like you can i'm going to keep it as red okay i'm going to keep the sky color as red next if you turn on the sky color button the ambient the occlusion will reflect the sky color over here so let us go back the energy level to 1.5 okay i'm going to rebake it out Okay, you can see the ambient occlusion reflects the sky color. 
okay this blackness causes because I have overlapped the UV of some of the wood or in this model so we are going back to the uh, white back to the white color by just pressing the plain button over here so I'm going to rebake it out okay it's going to generate us yeah has done the job for us okay after generating this ambient occlusion map you can save it out going to image save as AO map I'm going to save this as an image and you can use in the accelerator for your texture and we'll modify the ambient occlusion okay guys the ambient occlusion is over if you have any other doubt in generating the ambient occlusion you can just send me a mail I'll clear your doubt have a nice day guys bye we'll meet in next tutorial